Hey, welcome to Hard Science, the show where we use just a little bit of knowledge about the world to bend it to our whim. I'm Anthony. I'm Tara. And we got Michael with us from CDZA. Michael is a, a very trained musician. You can play many instruments. This this probably took years of training, right? Yeah. We were wondering if we could perhaps somehow um, just skip all the training and hard work you did and give ourselves perfect pitch yeah. with chemicals. Yeah, with science, anything is possible. That's what we like to hear, Michael. Today we are going to try to alter our singing voices using a couple different gases. Helium is a chemical element with the atomic number two. It is a colorless, odorless, tasteless, non-toxic gas that is the head of the noble gases on the periodic table. What do you think you know about gases? <laughs> We started you think from you the know, <laughs> You think you know about noble gases? It started from the bottom? Starts from <laughs> now it's here. Sulfur hexafluoride is an extremely potent greenhouse gas that is colorless, odorless, non-flammable, and also happens to make a great electrical insulator. Oh! Ah! Here, I got another You one. did that on purpose. No, I didn't. Helium is about six times lighter than air, whereas sulfur hexafluoride is a little over five times denser. And that is where the fun starts. Okay, so just to give you an idea of what the difference between these things looks like. Tara's got helium. I have the sulfur hexafluoride. One, two, three. Ah! <laughs> The pitch of your voice is determined by two things. The first is your vocal cords, and the second is resonance. So everybody has these cavities in their head and neck, your mouth, your nose, your nasal cavities, and all of those have their own natural frequencies. Kara! What? There are two of us now. Ah, you did it again! Ah, move so helium and sulfur hexafluoride don't change anything physically about your vocal cords, they just change those frequencies. So, just to give a better visual of this, remember this one is sulfur hexafluoride. That one's air. Oh! Oh, wow, it's way up there. There you go. Overflowed it. This is the gas level right here. That's unbelievable. Let's blow bubbles. Let's All right, it. man, I'm always down. There's like two layers. Some are down in the middle and the other ones are up on top. You can actually see them slowly sinking here too. Yeah. Because the bubbles are not completely airtight. You brought some instruments with you, right? I did. Oh look, you brought a fancy bugle. This is a uh, hot cross buns. I love that jam. Opus number two. Yeah. yeah. My grandparents got married to that song. Aww. Yeah. Okay, so now I'm gonna suck this in. Okay. And I'm gonna play it again and see what happens. Great. Are you haunted? <laughs> that was so shit. Ah! So you're gonna do helium. I'm gonna do. Oh, I'm gonna do helium because you well, get the cool of new course. one. <laughs> I mean, this is pretty much as expected. <laughs> <laughs> Do I sound sexy? Ah! Oh, that's terrifying. I think I sound better like this, actually. <laughs> this is Sienna. I'll save you. Help me. Come back. No. You know what? This is enough make-believe. It is time to sing. Oh God. We have our friend Mira here with us. We're gonna we're gonna sing in a quartet. Okay, so here's the deal. Uh, dudes have helium. Ladies have the sulfur hexafluoride. <laughs> That is a nightmare, no matter how we do it. Michael, they can catch all your videos where you're using your regular voice. What do you mean? This is my regular voice. Oh, okay. Well, you can see more of him singing like that, if that's your thing. Yeah, come along with me. At cdzamusic.com. <laughs> that's right. Uh, and if you want to let us know if there are any experiments you want to see us do, uh, you can tweet at us at Hard Science Show. Really, you got to. <laughs> <laughs> that's the only time I've ever had an intimidating battle cry. It's true. <laughs> My entire life. <laughs>